Hello, everybody. Great to be here again. My name is Star Master Bak Chu Young. <laughs> uh, how's everybody doing today? Are you as excited as I am? Yes? I'm very excited to be here, not because, um, not because just my success, right? But I'm excited to be here because I can see that each one of you here today, you can become successful through this system. So does that bring you a little hope, yes or no? Yes. And that's what I want to talk to you about. I want to talk to you about Adami's vision. I want to talk to you about how can just a regular person like me become successful? What's, what's the difference between Adami and other network marketing companies? Why is Adami different? That's what we have to learn and realize today, okay? So can I get a hand of individuals who are here for the first time? First time listening to Adami. First time. First timers. Wow, so many people, okay? And individuals who have been doing the business. Raise your hand. Raise your hand. Okay, very good, very good. So I want everybody to be encouraged, okay? I want this seminar to be something for individuals who have listened to this for the first time and for individuals who are continuing to do the business. And this hope is that you will one day become successful and why you will become successful, okay? So before I start, I want to talk a little bit about desire, okay? I think a lot of people understand, and if you ask them, do you want to become successful? I've never heard anybody say no, right? Everybody says, of course, I want to become successful, right? But do you really desire success, right? That's a, that's a question that you have to ask yourself, okay? So for me, I'm a father of two right now, right? I have, I have two boys. And right now, uh, my firstborn, he's here with me today. But whenever you take the kids to, let's say, the department store and you go to the toy section, okay, when they're younger, if they see a toy that they really want, what happens if you don't buy it for them? They start to cry, right? So you have to think about it a little bit. Why are they crying? It's because they want it really, really bad, right? They don't understand yes or no. They just want it. That's all, right? And when they're crying on the floor, do they care if somebody's looking at them? No. Do they care about other people looking at them or mommy saying no? No. All they want is that toy, right? So you have to drag them home, <laughs> right? But I feel like that's real desire in one aspect, right? That child doesn't understand anything. They don't know anything. All they know is they really want that toy. That's it. They don't care about eyes being on them. They don't care about people judging them. And so that's what I want to ask you. I think that's the kind of desire that we need to become successful in life. Now, a lot of people have tried to become successful, right? You've tried your first business, second business, First network marketing company, second, third, fourth. You've tried many different companies, but you have not been able to become successful. So why? Why have you not been able to become successful? So if we have the first one taken care of, so everybody here today, I will assume that you have a burning desire to become successful. Is that okay to assume? Okay. So if we have a burning desire to become successful, that means we have to work with a tool to bring us success. So the two different things that I want to talk to you is effort and ability. Okay? So there's a big difference between effort and ability. So let's say that everybody here today, I'm going to give you an English test. Okay? Just simple. So everybody here today, if I give you a test, the answers that you put on that piece of paper is your ability, your English ability, right? Your knowledge that you know. So if you get a 70% C, then that is your ability, right? You can't be angry about the score you get, right? And some of you, maybe you'll get a C. Maybe some of you will get an A. But something, but we all agree that whatever, whatever result is your result, right? That's, that's what we call how everybody has been um, judged until now. But the difference between Adam is this, okay? If I give everybody that test today, I can guarantee that everybody will get an A+. Plus. How? Because I changed the rules. Okay? In, in anatomy, it's like this. If I give you the test and I say, it is what? Your, your ability is this, to find the answer. You can look on the internet. You can do, open your book. You can look and ask the person next to you for the answer. So if I change the rules and I say on this test, it's an open book, you can go online, you can ask anybody around you. I can guarantee that everybody who is willing to look for the answer will get a what? 
A+. Plus. Do you agree, yes or no? So if that's atomy, don't you think that everybody here today can become successful? If they have the willingness and desire to look for the answers. That's what atomy is. And we can start by the company, okay? So atomy was created for individuals like you and me, for the average individual. And CEO Park, he desired to provide opportunity for individuals who want to become successful by providing a product that is absolute price and absolute quality. So that's the beginning of business. In any business, you are either selling a product or you are selling a service. That is it, right? The better your quality product is, the cheaper it is, the more consumers that you will gain. But when you do business, everybody can agree that it is very difficult to obtain a product that is high in quality and low in price to sell to the general public. It is very difficult. So here, let me draw a graph for you, okay? I call it the, the A and P graph, okay? One, two, three, four, five, okay? So everybody follow me. A stands for active income, okay? Active income. So what is active income? Active income means that you yourself personally put in 100% of your efforts to create something, okay? So one will stand for 100% of your effort. 100%. Everything starts like this. So if you have a small store, it is 100% your responsibility to open the store and to close the store, to stock the store, to train the employees, and to grow the store. If your store becomes successful, then you will have store one and two and three and four, and it will continue to grow. And as it grows, your effort becomes smaller, but your return remains the same or larger, right? So if you go all the way to P, what P is, 5 equals 0%, okay? So that means 0 of your personal action creates the income. So we call that passive income. Everybody follow me. Say passive income. Okay. Passive income is the opposite of active income, we can say, right? So passive income means that if you created something and you are just at home, not working, still money is coming into your bank account. Okay, so where do you want to be five years from now? Do you want to continue to be doing active income or do you want it to go to passive income? So how are we going to get to passive income, right? That's the question. So business, when we start it, it starts from A, from one. You have to be responsible in creating your business. But in order to create a business, we need to do a business that flows from top to bottom. Okay, so the river, you want to go with the river current. You don't want to go against the current, okay? So let's think about what that means, going against the current and going with the current, okay? If you go to a friend and you provide them with a product that is expensive, do you think they'll be more open to receiving that product and buying it from you? But if you go to them with a product that is cheaper and better than what they are currently using, they will be more likely to receive the information. They'll be more open-minded to listen to what you have, right? So that's what we, that's the feeling I want you to get from going from the current, going against it, and going with it, okay? So when we signed up for Atomy, did it cost you anything to sign up? No, zero registration cost. And at the same time, there's no maintenance fee. So any individual can start the business. So what that means is that you have a high percentage of success because you are not limiting your business partners. In other businesses, you are limiting it. You're closing the door to individuals who do not have the funds to start the business. You are closing the door for individuals who do not have the funds to maintain the business. So this is why Atomy allows for success because it allows for more opportunity, which means more chances for you to become successful. So from A to P, that is our desire to go, okay, from A to P. So let me talk to you a little bit about how to build consumers and why consumers become auto consumers. So this is one aspect of the business, okay. So from one aspect of the business, I want to show you that it can go from one to five. 
Why? Because when you're one, it is 100% your efforts to create consumers. Okay? So when you are here as a member, you decided to come to this seminar because you saw value. Why? Because you saw value in what Atomy is offering you. The testimonies we heard today and the product knowledge that we listened to today, if you listen to these testimonies, you hear over and over the value that Atomy gave to them. Right? If you're not able to provide value to individuals, then you will not have a sustainable business. What everybody will do is try to make a quick buck here and leave. But that's not what Atomy is about. Okay? So what happens is it is 100% your effort to build those consumers. But you jump to two. How do you go to two? Two, 75% of your effort, let's say, goes into building consumers again. But even if it's only 75%, you get more than 100%. Why? Because your consumers become auto consumers. Okay? So in the beginning, you meet your partners and you talk to your consumers and then later on they call you they say that oh my toner ran out oh my sun cream ran out I want this this and this those are called repurchases but you didn't call them who called you they called you so now they're introducing other individuals to you and at the same time you're now still building consumers but your consumer group is growing larger and larger so now you can go to go to three how can you go to three? Only 50% of your effort will now still create more than when you were building your consumers 100% of the time. Why is that? Because your auto consumers become part-time partners. So who are part-time partners? Part-time part partners are individuals who were auto consumers, but then they started to build their A line and B line. They saw value in the product that they were using, so they started to introduce to other people in a natural way. Okay? So a natural way is this. Let's say you are having a conversation with your friends, and your friends ask you, have you seen any exciting movies? And then you say, yeah. Matter of fact, I saw so-and-so, and it was fun. And you tell them. You just marketed the movie to them without thinking about it, right? That's what consumers do. Okay? Business partners are different. They initiate the conversation. They want you to talk about that movie. They want you to talk about that sun cream, right? So that's what the difference is here. These part-time partners, they see the benefit in talking about Atomy because it helps them, your, your friends, and it helps themselves. So what happens now is they are getting cash back, right? The 300K, the 300K that they now saw in the compensation plan, they have personally witnessed and had that money come into the bank account. So now they want to get more commission, right? And they want to tell other people about the value that Atomy presents. So now you're going from one to two to three, now to four. So these part-time individuals, we had a raise of hands, right? Individuals who are part-time and full-time. So let me give you the difference, okay? A lot of people think that they're doing Atomy part-time because they have another job. And some people think that they're doing Atomy full-time because they only have Atomy as a job. But I think that's false, right? Because I've seen full-time Atomians have worse results than part-time Atomians. So what does that mean? That means how well are you executing your goals and how diligent are you in order to accomplish these goals? I think the hardest job in the world is being a freelancer. Do you agree? Why? Because you are in control of your own schedule. If you don't want to wake up today and go to work, then you don't have to because you have no boss. Right? If it's raining today and you have a meeting at 1 o'clock, right, and you know it's going to take you two hours to get there in the rain, then if you don't have that burning desire to build your business, you are probably going to cancel your meeting and try to reschedule it for a day that suits who? You, right? That's why it is so difficult to become successful if you do not have the desire and the discipline to build your business. And individuals who have Atomy as a full-time job who do not have the discipline see very slow growth because they are actually not working. They're actually not building the business. But there are a lot of part-time individuals who are 
doing the business on their spare time, but they're actually doing the business. They're meeting individuals every single day. They're talking to individuals every single day and promoting what Atomy is doing for them and what it can do for you. But many individuals, so don't think about it as, am I full-time or part-time? But think about it as, how many hours a day am I actually dedicating to building this business? And then we can go look at those results. And that's what I'm talking about for these part-time partners, okay? These individuals are individuals who have the discipline to build, and they're maybe just working less hours than the other full-time. But this part-time individual, he starts to do the math. He's saying, wow, I've been working in Atomy for about a year and a half, two years, and I'm getting a steady stream of income, and I can see that me transitioning to full-time will be better in the long term. So what do they do? They become full-time partners. So me now, I'm only doing 25% of making new consumers, but I'm getting more than 100% of what I used to do. Why? Because now I have part-time partners doing one, two, and three. Now I have full-time partners who are doing one, two, and three, and four. Now these individuals, they are working with me to create the income. So my parents... They also had a burning desire to become successful, right? And they lived in Korea. And before I was born, they wanted the American dream, right? So they moved to the States. They moved to the States, and they were not able to speak English well, okay? So they were very limited to the kinds of jobs that they can do. So they started working in the kitchens and cleaning, and they started saving a little bit, a little bit, all the money that they had. And their dream was to become business owners, right? To live the American dream. Have the white picket fence with a beautiful house and kids running around in the yard. That kid was me, but I never had a yard to run around in. <laughs> so my parents went, and they tried to do the best that they could to accomplish that. But through one, two, three different businesses, I saw them do really, really hard work. But... I did not see them succeed, okay? So one day, I got a phone call from my, from my mom. She said, Jew, you have to buy a lawyer. I said, oh, no, why? Buying a lawyer, is that a good thing or a bad thing? That's a bad thing, right? And I said, why? She said, we have to file for bankruptcy. And I said, why? Why do we have to file for bankruptcy? And she told me the reasons why. But I didn't understand at that age, right? I didn't understand how can somebody who is working so hard Become bankrupt. Th does that make sense to you? To me, it didn't make sense. So after I filed for bankruptcy for them, every time I went to a gas station in the States, um, everything's self, right? So you're putting the gas in by yourself. Every time I saw a really nice car, I went up to the owner and I asked them what they did for a living. Right? I'm not talking about just a... BMW or Mercedes, right? To me, anybody can buy a BMW and Mercedes at the time because in the States, they're not that expensive, right? But Bentley, Lamborghinis, and Ferraris are expensive, right? It's like it's a cost of a house. You're driving around a house, right? So whenever I went and I saw these cars, I asked the owner, I said, what kind of work do you do? And 100%, not 99.9, .9, but 100% of everybody that I spoke to said they own their own business, all of them. And I asked them, I said, wow, really? My, my parents own their own business too. But they filed for bankruptcy. What's the difference? You know? And I asked them, and I only had 30 seconds, right? 30-second opportunity to talk to these individuals. And they told me this. They said, you will never become successful on your own. They said, you will always need to work with somebody to build success. So it is not about your own personal, it's not about your own personal ability, but it's about the ability of other individuals becoming your ability. So I didn't understand what that meant. And many of you today probably don't understand what that means. And I want to explain that to you, okay? So in this, in this framework, we can see that we go to five. Zero percent of my consumer building efforts will 
become reality, and at the same time, you will make money. But knowing this now, let's talk about the things that we need to choose to do, okay? So a lot of individuals have a choice between A, B, and C. But not a lot of individuals understand what they're choosing, okay? So an A is a job. I want to talk to you about a job, okay? It's very easy to think about, but in order to get a good job, you have to go where? You have to graduate from a, a good school, right? Everybody agrees? The better the school, the better the job, right? And you have to go to school for how many years? Four years, university, right? And I like, I like saying it like this, right? I believe that every single person, okay, who goes to a good university, the minimum amount of debt that they have is about 10,000 USD a year, okay? Even if they have a scholarship, okay? So let's think about this. So you're investing, let's just talk about time. Four years of your life going to university, and then two years, it usually takes time to look for that job that you want, right? So it's about six years. So six years later, you have a minimum of $40,000 to $60,000 in debt in the States, okay? And the regular job that they get is for the hopes of making $1,500 to $3,000 a month. We would, we would consider this good income, yes or no, right? $1,500 to $30,000 to $3,000, okay, let's say. But let's think about the dream that you want to accomplish, okay? If you could send your child to any school that you want, what school would you send them to right now? Right? And how much does that cost a year? How much does that cost a year? Lots of money. With this income, can you do that? No. Even if you went to this amazing university, it doesn't work like that. Okay? Now think about the house, the car that you want right now. With this income, will you be able to accomplish that? No. Okay? So what I'm saying to you is A is not enough is what I'm saying. Everybody has to have a job, of course, right? You have to have a source of income to feed the family, to do your own work. But if we remain at one, if we remain with A, just a regular job, no matter how hard you work, you will not be able to accomplish those dreams. You will not be able to give your children or your loved ones the life that you want to provide for them. It doesn't work that way. So what do people do? They say, okay, if it's not just A, then maybe I should do this, which is sales. Sales is easy to get into. Why? It doesn't take much to invest in, right? So let's talk about sales and why I disagree, why I think that that is not the road that you need to take right now. When I was 16, my parents told me, since I always worked for myself, um, I would buy goods and sell in the flea markets. I would do odd jobs here and there, and I made money when I was younger, right? But my parents told me, they said, listen, you have to work for somebody right? You have to know what it feels like to have a boss. And I said, okay. And when I was 16, I got my first official job, right? Official job, legal job. And I worked, I, I worked for a credit card company selling credit cards, okay? So that was my first job. So when I went into that company to sell the credit cards, I realized very quickly how limited I was in the income that I could make. Why? Because if you're in sales, how many hours a day do you work? About eight hours. Even if you want to work 20 hours, people sleep, right? Even if you're awake, they're sleeping, so you can't sell anything to them. So you, can, you only have about eight hours a day that you can actually work. And how long does it take to explain to them and to get to the next appointment? About two hours. It takes about two hours. So technically, you can only meet four people a day. That's it. But every time you meet them, do they buy your goods? No. So even if you had a 100% success rate, it would still only an income ceiling of four per day. So is that good money or no? To me, it was no. So I said, okay, that's not good. But listen, we live in a society now where information is available at our fingertips. Everybody has a smartphone, right? So it is no longer easy to make money in sales. Why?
because your consumer knows how much you're making. If they know the product that you're selling them has a 30% markup, they're not going to be happy with you selling it to them with that 30% markup. Or even if it's a sunscreen or cosmetics, they want samples, right? Samples are not free, but they want more and more because they see that you're making a big commission. Agree? So it becomes harder and harder to do sales in this environment because everybody knows how much you are making. It's the same thing. Let's say that you bought a used car. At first, you thought you got a good deal because you don't know how much that person bought that used car for before selling it to you. So you bought it for, let's say, $5,000, okay? It's a beautiful car, good condition, everything, right? But then you figure out he bought it for $1,000. Are you going to be happy? As soon as you find out the information, you are no longer happy because you see the difference that they profited from you, okay? That's why it doesn't work anymore. That's why it's more difficult to be in this department. So where do we need to go? What department do we need to be in, okay? So this is where I want to talk to you about, and this is where I want you to have hope and understanding. A lot of individuals who are doing this business are not accustomed to how network marketing, how Atomy is doing network marketing. Everybody is only accustomed to direct selling. That's it, okay? Direct selling is sales. That's all it is in my eyes. You are buying a product for discounted price and you're selling it to that person for a margin and making a profit. Is that active income or is that passive income? That's active income. So if you are doing active income, then from the A to P, you are at one. You'll never get to five. And the point of five is to retire one day to have that income and to be able to give that ID to, your, to the next generation. That's the goal. So how do we get there? The only way to get there is to be able to do a business that changes consumer habit, okay? So think about this. When you go to the market to buy milk, okay? Let's say that, close your eyes right now. Go, imagine yourself in that supermarket where you always buy milk, okay? You're walking, you're talking on the phone, you're going, you're going, you're going. Where is your hand going? What milk does your hand go to? Okay, open your eyes. What milk did you grab? The milk you always purchase. Right? But is there only one brand or are there multiple brands? There are multiple brands, but where's your hand going? Always to the milk that you always purchase. That's it. Why? Because you have a habit of consuming that milk. When will you change that habit? That habit will only be changed when a different milk provides you with more value. That is it. If you do not have a business that can provide your consumers with more value, your business will inevitably fail. Even if it looks like you're doing great now, it will fail. That's why there are so many network marketing companies who cannot last 10 years. That's why there are so many leaders who go from one network marketing company to the next network marketing company to the next network marketing company until they've been to 10 different network marketing companies. But in Atomy, I can promise you that this will be your if this is your first, this will be your last. And if you've been to many other ones, you don't need to go anywhere else. Just stay here. Why? Because Atomy has a one server network where we are now, we are now distributors. We are now business owners who sell the best quality possible at the most reasonable price possible. You will never be able to beat Atomy as an independent business. You will not be able to sell an Omega-3 at the price that Atomy is selling it right now. It's not possible. Go do your homework. Go to the other network marketing companies and see how many capsules they're selling for how much. You cannot beat Atomy's price. So individually, what we can think is we are now a CEO of each product. We are an Omega-3 factory. We are a Hemoin factory. We are a skincare factory. Everything that you see up here and all the products that will be available in Atomy, you, 
It's the same thing as you becoming the owner, the CEO of that company, because you have no risk. The other companies, when they're making that coffee or that omega-3, they have great risk. If they don't sell it, what's going to happen? They're going to have to close the door. But you, you don't have to worry about anything. All you have to do is build consumers. That's it. Please tell me if there's another business model in the world that's better than Atomy. There is not. It's not possible. That's why we call Atomy a miracle. That's why everybody in Atomy who has become successful, we can all be humble and say that it is not by my own ability, but it is by what? What, the C what CEO Park has provided for us and the synergy of heart that we're talking about. For example, today in this stage, I'm here, right? I'm speaking to you all. In other network marketing companies, other leaders do not speak to other lines. It's not possible because they steal, right, lines, because they want their own members. But here today, I'm leading this lecture and talking to you, and if you choose to do Atomy, it does not personally, PV-wise, benefit me. It does not. But with a deep burning desire, I want you to do Atomy, even if it doesn't benefit me. Why? Because somebody else in another part of the country is speaking to my partners over there because I can't go there. But their partners are here. So what are we doing? We're working together to build together. Do you understand? So this is not the way that we want to go. Where we want to go is this, okay? We want to change consuming habit, okay? We want to change consuming habit. And the only way we can change consuming habit is to give value, okay? So if you want to be rich, you have to be first to choose that before everybody else chooses it. Even CEO Park said that, right? He said, individuals who choose and see the benefits of what Atomy will provide for them in the future are the individuals who will become wealthy. But if, if, if it's... You choose it now, it's too late. It's like this. If I say coffee, what company comes to your mind? Starbucks. Did you study Starbucks? No, but why do you say Starbucks? Because they changed your consuming habit. If I say hamburgers, what do you think about? What? Okay. Did, did you study that? No. But those companies change your consuming habit. So today... It would be too late for you to create another Starbucks, right? It's already done. But Atomy is new. It is future distribution, okay? That's what I call it, okay? It is the future. Why is it the future? Because every single consumer desires value. It's like this. If you go to Korea and you go to a coffee shop, this is the pattern, okay? So the first coffee shops, let's say that there's only one coffee shop in your neighborhood, okay? If you go to that coffee shop, they provided you with what you paid for, a cup of coffee. But their service was horrible, let's say. Right? The owner was very rude. So you have to decide, am I going to give up coffee or am I going to just take on the rudeness? Okay? So let's say that they, you can't give up coffee because you're addicted. You love your coffee. Okay? But you decide one day, well, let me make a coffee shop then. Okay? So let's say that you make a coffee shop. So this is the first coffee shop, second coffee shop. In, in your coffee shop, are you going to be rude or nice? You're going to be nice because you want to draw those consumers from coffee shop one to where? To your coffee shop, right? But then another consumer comes to your coffee shop and says, oh, wow, look at this. I think I can be nice and provide more coffee, right? So... The third coffee shop, what do they do? They have nice service, and then they size up for free. Now another fourth one opens. This time, size up and price down. Right? So, and then the fifth one opens. Fifth one, what is it? Size up, price down, and what? A coupon. Buy 10, get one free. But there has to be an end. There has to be an end, right? Because in every business model, there is product cost. You can only go so much, so far back. 
Okay? So once you're providing the 10 stamps and one free coffee, you're initially what you're doing is you're giving your consumers money. That's what it is. You're giving them money. Okay? So in distribution, what do you think the end is? The end is atomy, where consumers get paid for being a consumer. That's all atomy is. We first make money from the product. Because if you are an omega-3 consumer, you can't buy, or let's say the absolute skincare, you can't buy that quality for that price. So being a consumer in itself, you have just made money. The second part is this. Now being a consumer, by sharing with other individuals, you make an income. That's the end of distribution. There is no more that they can give you, right? So if you look at Atomy's business model about revenue, about 35% cash back to the consumers, theoretically speaking, the business cannot continue to function by giving you 50%, 65%. You know other network marketing companies, they say, we'll give you 75%. Don't listen to that because that's a lie. You have to think about it like this. Even in that 75%, how many different bonus plans are there within that, within that compensation? People only listen to the 75, but if you think about it, there are literally 10 different plans in that 75. And you can technically only be able to get maybe 5 to 10% max. But at Atomy, in the 35%, we have general commission, mastership bonus, and center. But all we have to think about is the general and the mastership. And within Within those two, they naturally flow together. So just by building a network and generating general commission, you will be able to make $50,000 a month. Is there any other plan that's structured in any way like this? No, there really is not. Okay? So your goal is to what? Is to never give up and continue to build. How simple is that? Right? Is there, is there any, anything else that you have to do? No. Never give up means this. Continuing to come to the seminars and educating yourself and giving value to other people that you meet. And then inviting those individuals here. And then you are what? What are you doing? You are continuing to build that downline by not, never giving up. And it's inevitable. I use the word inevitable because, I want, because that happened to me, right? When I first started Atomy, I, I understood this structure, and I worked really hard, okay? The first month I did Atomy, I worked about 300 hours. So how many hours is that? That's 10 hours a day for 30 days, okay? 10 hours a day, 30 days, and I made $73.30, okay? $73.30. Did I make a lot of money? Yes or no? See? You have to say yes, Okay? You still don't understand the compensation plan, but watch. Everybody says no because they don't. The only thing that's running through their head is hours worked and paid out. That's it. But we need a change of mindset, okay? So listen to what this means, okay? So the first time I got paid in Korea, you get a bank account and they stamp it, okay, with the initial amount that you got uh, transferred. And I took that bank account and I showed everybody around me. I said, look, 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 money came in, money came in. And they said, what? 7330. I said, what are you, why are you looking at that so hard? He said, are you sure you're not missing a zero? I said, no, it's 7330, not 730. And he said, wow, you really been brainwashed. Right? He said, you really been brainwashed. Adamy got you good, right? And I said, no, no, you don't understand business because this is what this means, okay? This means that. I created 12, 12 consumers, okay? Business is about repeats, okay? So let's say your cell phone. In order for your cell phone to work, there has to be cell phone towers, okay? Before even making $1, that company had to invest money to make those cell phone towers, right? No, they didn't make any money, but they still had to invest. In Atomy, it's this. It's not money, but it's time. You have to invest your time to create consumers who give Atomy, who, who see Atomy as giving them value. 
So 12, this is what I did. I said, listen, it's not about 300 hours that I worked in this payout. It's about how many consumers did I make that are going to continue to use my product. The first time around, these individuals don't trust Atomy. So they only purchase one to two items. But then after they see that Atomy is giving them value, these 12 individuals who only purchase 12, multiply that by five minimum. So now my income is going up and up and up. So what happened was after nine months of doing this, I became an auto sales master. Nine months. When I mean auto sales master, that means once I became a sales master, I never dropped. I was a sales master every 15 days from that day on, every single day. And after one year, I was making more than $3,200 a month. From how much? From $7,350. So that is only possible because it was not just me working, but it was going from that A to P. My partners started seeing the value of what Atomy was providing for them, and we worked together to build the team. But within that team, those consumers decided not to run away because why? There's nowhere to run away to. Where are you going to go to buy skincare that de-ages and has anti-aging supplements like Atomy at this price? Nobody will be able to provide you with that. The toothpaste, the toothbrush, all these things. That's why Atomy is a wonderful business model. Because your partners, you can be like me, not very pretty, and still sell skincare, no problem. Because they're not buying it looking at you. They're buying it because they see value in the product. So look at Atomy as a business, not about your personal experience. Okay? I want to give you a tip. Okay? I have lots of men coming to me and telling me, I cannot sell skincare because I personally have not been able to benefit from the skincare. That's what they tell me, right? And I, I don't understand. I say, listen, let's, let's think about the other way. Even if you benefited from the skincare, does that mean everybody you meet will benefit from the skincare? No. But then why do you have so much confidence telling them about it when they will still say, well, I don't know. It's the opposite. It's the same thing. Even if you don't benefit, do you think everybody that you see will not benefit then? No. So I tell them, there are more than just skincare, right? Just look for one item that you love. Introduce that item that you love to them with passion, and then show them that you have this many more. Do you understand? It's about talking to them and giving them value and helping them to choose what it is that they need and talking to them about what they want to hear, not telling them what you want to say. There's a big difference. If you keep telling them just what you want to say, they're going to get annoyed. They don't want to hear it. They don't want to listen. It's like my students. When I was teaching at university, I had a group of university students who, if I was to say it like how normal people say the business, I, they would not have become my consumers. But this is what I did. They were talking and they said, oh, man, I went to the department store this weekend and I saw this handbag that I really loved, but it was so expensive I couldn't buy it. And I said, how much was it? They said it was $500. So $500, wow. I said, I'll buy it for you. They said, what? You'll buy it for me? I said, yeah, I'll help you buy it. That's how I introduced Atomy to them. That's Atomy right there. But see, people don't understand that. And I say, listen, how? How, professor? How can I buy my bag? And I say, listen, what kind of skincare do you use? And she told me on average she uses uh, $300 products. And I said, listen, Atomy's only $80 in Korea. So that's $220 that you save. And I said, within six months, what can you do? Buy a handbag. And they say, wow, thank you so much. I literally helped them buy a handbag, yes or no? I talked to them and told them what they wanted to hear. But if I would have said, hey, do you know Atomy? You know Atomy has skincare, and this, they would not have listened. They only listened because they wanted to buy their handbag. And I said that I would buy it for them. 
That's the way that you have to talk to individuals around you. Give them value and talk to them about what they want to hear, not about what you want to say. So that's how this, this graph works, okay? So changing consuming habit is the way that we have to go. And if you're not able to do that in this business, you're not able to do that in any business. So think about it like this. All the other network marketers that I've met in the Philippines, they have a very difficult time building Atomy. Because in the Philippines, everybody wants to buy it directly and they want margin now. Okay? I understand, right? That's, that's the problem that we are all having, right? But it is inevitable that their consuming habit will change within the next 10 years. Yes or no? Yes. It will change. Internet speed, is it getting slower or faster? Faster. Packages, are they getting here slower or faster? Faster. Everything is building and upgrading. Atomy is already an upgraded version waiting for everybody to upgrade with them. Do you understand? Don't go backwards. Atomy has already created a system where they see progress and they understand the way that the business model needs to go. It's like that all over the world. It's no longer about B, sales, because that is too late. Everybody already knows how much you're making. But in Atomy, every consumer that registers within the website, even if you're a business leader like me or you or just a regular consumer, everybody buys the products for what? The same price. And everybody has the same opportunities as we have. That is the only way you can create real passive income. Because without that, everybody will continue to be calling you forever and ever and ever. Even 10 years down the road, everybody's going to call you for the products that they can buy from you for cheaper. But in Atomy, we do not have that problem. Because as we build this system, and as every individual becomes a member, and as you educate them, and as things change within countries, everybody will understand and evolve to become true Atomy networkers. But if we try to do it then, when everybody is changing and has changed their consuming habit, it will already be what? Too late. That's why I say this is a long game that we're playing. And even if it looks like it's taking a long time, it is not. Because, why? Because in all those other network marketing companies, it looks like you're making an income right away, but then what happens to your downline? It just disappears again. And then where do you have to go again? To a new company. And then another company. And then another company. So your reliability and trust starts to diminish. And therefore, your business building opportunity, the more companies that you do and the more companies that you introduce to them, the less reliability that you have. But anatomy, it continues to grow over and over and over. That's why it works. So after nine months, I became a sales master. And after about a year and a half to two years, I became a member of the Leaders Club, right? The Leaders Club members are individuals who make over 100K a year, okay? And then now, you see this badge? CEO Park now made a badge for the leaders. So now... Royal Leaders members, they get this. And Royal Leaders members are individuals who make over 200K a year. Okay? So how many of you here want this badge? Right? I guarantee that you will be able to get this badge if you don't quit. Because anatomy, it is not about your personal ability, but it is about your effort. How much work are you willing to put in? to bring about success for your loved ones. Even when it's raining, are you willing to go out? Even if you get rejected, are you willing to go back? Even if it looks hard and impossible, are you willing to have faith to go on? That is what I want you to answer for yourself today. Because Adamy has already done everything for you. There's nothing else for you to look into. Adamy is already done. 
What I mean is, Atomy is now already a billion dollar company with over 10 locations globally. There's nothing else you need to look into. It's about, am I willing to put in the work needed to become successful? And if the answer is yes, I guarantee every single one of you here today will, will become successful. Do you agree? Yes. Don't give up. Keep going. And always, always persevere. Thank you.